Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Um, tonight we started off our night routine with setting up her new bubble machine and as you can see, she absolutely loved it and that kept her occupied while I got dinner ready. When the weather is nice, we love to take advantage of it and we will use our grill. So tonight, Corley is going to have a sweet potato and then we will have a regular potato each and veggie burgers and cream style corn. Now that dinner is cooking, I just came back outside to play with the kids. And let me tell you, he loves his swing. I mean, he can be in it for an hour and never gets bored of it. Look how cute he is. <laughs> and Coralie, of course, loves going down her slide and playing on her water table. Corley was so happy. She saved a little ladybug from the water. Um, so she's just playing with it there and then she put it in the grass. Now I'm just getting dinner ready to put it on the table. And you'll notice I put so much ketchup all over it, but honestly, my kid is obsessed with ketchup and she eats it on practically everything. Here you see me serving the two big kids in the family and they're just patiently waiting on their food and Colin just couldn't hang with us. He was really tired so he laid down for a nap but you'll see he joins us shortly. I never really grew up eating at a kitchen table and just having pure family time without a TV or anything. So I have incorporated that into our lives and honestly it's the best. We can sit there and have conversations and just talk about our day, uh, joke around with Coralie. You'll see she's making a bunch of funny faces at her dad. You make a mess? No. Colin decided to wake up from his nap, so he joined us for dinner and he is going to have banana baby food. After dinner, I decided to go on and clean up the kitchen and do the dishes instead of waiting until nighttime because the kids were so content outside, so they went back out there with Bob and I will join them in a little bit.
went back outside to play a little bit more and right now Coralie is getting a bath, um, Bob is doing that and then I'm going on and fixing Colin's bottle to get him ready for bed. And now I'm going on and changing him. He wiggles so much he hardly even fits on this changing table anymore and a lot of the time I do change him in the bed. After Coralie is washed up from her bath, she'll usually stay in there a little bit longer and play with her bath toys. And during this time, we're giving Colin his kisses and his bottle and putting him to bed. Now that Coralie is out of the bath, uh, we will go on and set up her toothbrush. I'll let her brush her teeth first while I'm brushing her hair. And then after she gets done, then I'll go on and brush her teeth again. Usually by the end of the day her room is a pretty big mess so tonight her and her dad went in there and started straightening up and it looks to me like she picked out a book for us to read tonight which is so cute. I'm not sure why, but she decided to pull my head down and kiss my forehead and then push me back away, but it was honestly the cutest thing. I don't know what prompted her to do it, but it literally melted my heart. But this is a weekend night, so we decided to just go on and go on the couch and read our book there instead of her room. And then we finished that up by watching Boss Baby. Now it's time to put Coralie to bed. This is her new thing. Every night she has to be carried like this and say swimmy, swimmy, swimmy and kick her legs. Honestly, it's so cute. Tonight we did two rounds, but you're going to notice that she sleeps on her sleeping bag. She honestly prefers to sleep on the floor, so I'm not real sure why. Maybe we need to get her a bigger bed. She doesn't like hers, but this is the end of our night routine. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like this video and subscribe to my channel to see future videos and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!